Hello, my name is April Christofferson and I'm an occupational therapist with I Am Home. Today we're going to discuss the progressive disease, Parkinson's disease, and if you and or a loved one are suffering from this disease, what you might expect from it. As always, if you suspect that you or a loved one might be suffering from Parkinson's disease and have yet to be diagnosed, please immediately consult with your primary care physician or health care provider for the best treatment options. First of all, Parkinson's disease usually affects adults between the ages of 50 and 60 years of age. It is a slowly progressing disease that affects the neurological use of the brain. What you'll notice is that there might be a tremor when you're actively awake and this tremor may affect one arm, one leg, or just one side of the body. You're going to notice a minimal tremor at first and as the disease progresses you'll notice a more evident progression of the tremor. You might also notice that it's difficult for you to transition between a lying or sitting position and a standing position. To initiate those movements may get more difficult as the disease progresses. You'll notice an aching or rigidity in your muscles and that your muscles don't want to move as fluidly as they once used to. So they may be rigid in their movement rather than fluid in their movement. You may notice a weakness of the facial area and or the throat muscles, which can make feeding and eating difficult for you or your loved one. This is very frustrating as this is an area that's often pleasurable for us and it can be really discouraging, which leads us to talk about the symptom of depression, which can accompany Parkinson's disease due to the loss of independence. You'll notice also that we have balance and gait disturbances when you're walking or when you're just standing. These can cause safety issues that you need to be aware of and you need to be cognitively able to think through what safety issues you or a loved one might have and you may need to alter your home environment to address these issues. If you or a loved one is suffering from Parkinson's disease, there is hope and help in the method of the I Am Home therapy. This is a home therapy.